just made it to the beautiful city of Amsterdam. We are staying in a houseboat. This might be one of the most unique accommodations we've ever stayed at, so let me give you a tour. Right on the water. So this is our boat studio space. We booked it on Airbnb. So we have a full-size kitchen over here with a coffee machine. We have a little dining table. They decorated it very nicely. This is a super cool feature. Circular submarine window thing. <laughs> and here is the bed. I do not recommend staying here if you're not comfortable with the person you are staying here with because there is no door to the bathroom. It is simply a toilet hidden behind the bedroom wall. Technically, if you're sitting on the toilet, you can poke your head out, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then on the other side, you have the shower. So after all like the fees and taxes and cleaning fee, this was about 70 a night. So Amsterdam is a city that has more bikes than people. We have 870,000 people here and around 3 million bikes estimated. The city is really designed for bikes in mind and there is specific paths and like roads for bikes and it is really the most efficient way to get around the city. Vondel Park is a great place to practice if you haven't rode a bike in a while. I would say just be cautious because there are a lot of rules and stuff that you need to know. I haven't rode a bike in like 10 years so I think I'm gonna avoid it this time. We are about to embark on a boat tour here in Amsterdam. So we booked it through Airbnb. The tickets were $26 per person, and it comes with snacks, drinks, and an hour-long boat ride along the canal. Amsterdam has over 165 canals that total over 100 kilometers in length. While we were on the boat, there was a bar on board, and our guide made everyone drinks while he shared some history about the city. The name Amsterdam comes from the Amstel River and the dam that was created in the 13th century to avoid floods from the South Sea. We just got done with the museum and I highly recommend booking this. There's a ton of really great museums in Amsterdam, but we heard really great things about the Vincent van Gogh Museum and he is one of my favorite artists as well. It's just so crazy to learn about his life, his travels, and how his work has like changed over time. So we booked these tickets online. It was 20 euros per person and I highly recommend booking things in advance because things book up really quickly. That will do it for our trip in Amsterdam. This is definitely the most unique city we've ever been to. There's so many things to do here for kids and adults. There's a wide variety of things for pretty much anyone to do here. So this will be our final stop in Europe. We had an incredible time in Europe, but starting tomorrow, we start our trek through Asia, beginning in Bangkok, Thailand. So far we have one week booked there, and then we still don't know where we're going after that. We're still just booking as we go. So thanks for watching this video, and stay tuned for our journey through Asia.